Welcome back. Let's play some more 10 minute games on Shogi Wars. So lately I've been attempting to play Central File Rook. Uh, good luck. Let's continue. Well, our opponent prefers Bishop Exchange opening. So Central File Rook might not be the meta against... Uh, well, so okay. It seems like they're not playing their preferred opening. So let's let's play my preferred opening, just to make it even. Uh, this is aggressive, by the way, in case that's not clear. I am playing as Gota, so I have to play a bit judiciously. Um. All right, I'm actually just going to go out of my way to block my bishop if they do this, because they've blocked their pawn. Um, let's get my king out of here before things go horribly wrong. All right, I am profoundly confused by what I've done and by what they've done. But we're going to keep moving and try to surround this king. Mm-hmm. <laughs> bishop in the corner castle, eh? Is that what we're doing today? I don't think they're going to move the bishop into the corner. That's funny to imagine, isn't it? Um. Mm -hmm. Alright, so I can take some space for free here. Without consequence. Um... Right, so they really want to target the head of my bishop here. Um, I'm trying to imagine how this might work out. If I move my gold, then... Um, Weaknesses open all over the place here. Um, we're still going to move it. Normally I push the pawn to 5-5. Five five, um, but today we're feeling adventurous. They do say in the bishop exchange opening, do not um, move your center pawn. And I have violated that principle. And we'll see how I get punished for it. For such a violation. On the bright side, my formation of cat, uh, pieces seems to have some strength and some weakness. So... Um, it's not a complete loss. Alright, so this is weak. Oh fuck, could I have dropped this in the corner? Probably they would have tried to trap my bishop if I did, but still. I should be considering possibilities before, not after, I make my moves. I'm just a bit anxious, because our opponent keeps moving and moving, and I can't keep up with their pace. Um, all right, so we're going to move my center silver in order to keep some general somewhere close to my king. Uh, they insist on breaking in over here. Uh, okay then. Um, yeah, that's actually well-timed.
That's really well timed. Okay. Well, this is going to be ugly. Um I thought I had a point here. The problem is it's not a good point. Um hmm. All right, how much trouble am I in? They push, I take, they take, I take, they take. I, you just keep taking back and forth. Right, I saw this. And this is what prompted my question. All right, this looks at least somewhat interesting. Gofun. I thought I saw something here. Am I just hallucinating? Or did I see anything? I don't know. Alright, we're going to take this. Because I'm still somehow missing the point. They can drop here again, can't they? How many times do I forget how this thing works? And how many is too many? So, yeah, I've trapped my rook. Oh yeah, this is also a trap. Sure. Um, interesting. My brain is not operating as it needs to. I keep seeing idea after idea, but they're not great. Not even good. Alright, so we're exchanging a rook for a gold general. While our opponent continues to invade heavier and heavier. Um... Something. Yep, they get to attack over here while I still struggle to find something. But I can hit the rook. Uh, 
At least on its face, this seems reasonable. Yeah, they could move this to block my attack. That's possible. I'm intending to push this pawn. Things could get complicated, but might not. Um... Mm -hmm. All right. They have two pawns in hand. So... Hmm. I wish I had more options here. So we're going to have a five general castle, and it's going to be a mess. Um... But yeah, I can push this pawn next. Well, if I had a turn to push it, I could. Um, Ippun Sanjubio. Okay, we're going to take here and pray that things work out. Apparently sitting for nine minutes in a game doesn't make your moves better. Still need to make good moves. No matter how much you pretend, you need to actually just do the work and find the good moves. Um... That's a blunder. Oh goodness. Yeah, this lance move is a more grave blunder than I thought. It's not easy to defend this, especially with the knight in hand. Alright. Um Sorry, I'm thinking. What confused me here is that the piece I need is the lance. But to get that lance, I need to do other things first. That's super dangerous on my part, but yeah, I'm in deep doo-doo here. Crap. Yeah, 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 if I'd paid more attention, I would have seen that coming. All right, fine. Do your worst. I have no time to think. Um... Thanks for the game. Well played.
One down, two to go. Good luck. Uh, this is interesting already. Sure, let's aim directly at the bishop, shall we? Let's continue this policy. It looks interesting. Where am I going to castle if I keep this up? Let's defend these pawns in the middle. Yes, yeah, so they defend their bishop quite reasonably so, I think. Um, I'll avoid pushing my center pawn, because it looks like we might exchange bishops here. Ah, uh, this is interesting too. No, there's no winning tactic here. I'm just going to play some semblance of a normal opening. Okay, that's risky. Um, all right, I think this is a risk I want to take. At the very least, this is going to wake me up. Alright, so they defend this point. Which prevents me from doing this bishop drop to win a pawn. Um, I could still drop it. No, right, it's still defended. <laughs> Hello. Um, so... Uh, they obviously want this bishop 5-5 five five to be some kind of awesome shot that wins material. I'd like that not to win material. So, how do I defend this? I don't know, man. Hmm. Hopefully this isn't a blunder. I just don't know enough patterns to know like what's completely outlandish and what might be doable. Um, all right, that's aggressive. I'll give you that. Well, I'm feeling greedy. So, I'm going to play a greedy move. So this forces them either to defend this point or to sack the knight. Which they might have been planning to do anyway. Alright, there's a knight sacrifice if I want to take the knight. Um... Yeah, there are three pieces bearing down on this point, so I might want to do something about it. Oh. Oh, crud. <laughs> this is more dangerous than I thought, because this fork is still present. Um, Not enough. Interesting. Alright. Well, let's defend my rook. Defending the rook seems, at least at first glance, it sounds reasonable. Oh no, not that fork. <laughs> I mean, considering all the other terrible stuff that could have happened, this is not so bad. Um,
we'll use this bishop to defend this direction. Maybe they'll take the lance. I don't know. They do. All right. Um. Mm hmm. This is what happens when I get greedy. And when I don't, like, calculate properly. Or, I'm sorry, read is the word we use for this game. Calculate's the one we use in chess. Um, Alright, let me take this. So I'm attacking the castle from the right. Maybe threatening to drop a silver somewhere? Oh, goodness. Really? Well, then. Um, interesting. Aren't we full of surprises today? Um, what does this actually do, if anything? It looks scary. Gofun. I don't get it. All right, let's give up on attacking uh, directly and just take more pieces. Because I'm down four minutes on the game clock and I'm not thinking of anything convincing here. The harder I try to win, the more mistakes I'm going to make. So... At some point, you just get exhausted. And you have to regroup and find your focus again. So Knight Takes Pawn is interesting. Um, actually, they have potentially a Rook drop on this line, and like this gold move is super weakening. Yeah, I think this is probably what they should be doing here. Um, so I'm trying to avoid exchanging too many pieces while my king is under attack. And, yeah, I think I'm going to survive this. Um, I didn't expect that. Hmm. When I keep trying to simplify this game, they keep making it more complicated. Um, well, this is my lightest move in the position, as it doesn't require me to drop anything. So... If there's a tactic, I've missed the tactic here. Ah, that was the tactic they were threatening. All right. Well, now we see it. I'm just not awake. 
I'm impressed. <laughs> Thankfully, all my moves some have at least boom. some merit, but yeah, this is, that's a pretty big miss on my part. Um, I'm not used to dealing with this particular position, so I'm not sure what to recommend. I mean, this can't be terrible, but I don't like giving them a general while they're attacking, but they're always attacking until they're not. Um, Nifun. Mm hmm. I did see that coming. The thing is, removing this pawn might accelerate my attack. So, everything is double-edged. There's a good and a bad side to each move. Also, I'm down five minutes with, like, no hope here, but... Let's hold out hope regardless. Um, let's remove that. Try to defend my king a little bit. And then finally take this damn lance in the corner. Unless I can find something better. It's not easy. Optimism. Perhaps reckless optimism. Like, why that particular square? I don't know. Um, why this particular square? I don't know.
I'm moving faster, though, since I'm under severe time pressure. But, yeah, maybe I should have retreated this horse and called their bluff on this silver drop. And then a silver in the corner would have been a more effective attacking piece. But then a silver gets stuck in the corner. Um, let's try to defend this position. Also, pawn down here would not be a terrible idea, although it's slow. But my back rank is so vulnerable here. Fuck. <laughs> I could have taken this, probably. But... Uh, I don't have time to... I don't have time to figure out these concerns. Um, here goes nothing. In the rhetorical sense, anyway. Possibly in the literal sense. I don't know how good this attack is. Couldn't find a mate. I didn't budget my time. I did not budget my time. Yep. All right. Thanks for the game. I could have moved the other piece there, too. That didn't occur to me. Yeah, game. Good luck. Games on Shogi Wars are something else. It's just how the rules are set up. It's entertainment, isn't it? Whoa. Whoa, buddy. Really? Is this a thing? I mean, after that last game, who am I to question anything? But still. Alright, screw this. Let's have some fun. Alright.
Mm-hmm. You don't say. All right. Um... Maybe I shouldn't put my king over here. I don't know. Okay, well, we've got a position here with pieces on squares. Time for her, but the prize... Yes, I saw that. Ah, uh, so... Yeah, to break that up into multiple statements here, so everybody plays with an avatar. Uh, Katagami Sebendan, uh, I believe is a former head of the uh, Japanese Shogi Association. If I play my cards correctly, I have a decent... Ch that I don't believe, but okay. I mean, you have to win a lot of games to do that, if I'm not mistaken. If I read things correctly, maybe I didn't. Um, I'm mistaken. Okay. I accept that I'm mistaken then. Still seems unlikely, but yeah, that, um, at least, yeah, you're saying it's possible. I was reading that, like, the top 100 players or something got awarded that, and various people got other, like, analysis tickets or something like that. Oh. Okay. I see. So that's how I have a chance here. Interesting. Um, my rook is floating. That's not good. What do we do about the floating rook? I don't know, man. Well, they say not to push the center fall pawn in a bishop exchange opening, but we're pushing it. It looks interesting. Uh, prizes are based on class performance. Okay. Nanafun. Hmm. What a difficult position. This diagonal always, or this file always ends up being useful when I'm attacking that particular castle. Um. Interesting. Oh, that was the point. Very well. Um, I 
probably should have seen that coming. So yeah, they get a horse, and they have a solid castle, but we've got freedom. That means something, right? No? Alright, well, I guess not. Oh, <laughs> yeah, 10 second shogi. Could be fun to do a lot of that. I've been meaning to switch it up anyway. Gofun. All right, this is my crazy style of attack. It's the only piece that can defend this is the rook, and the rook chooses to babysit. Obviously, my crazy attacking style is a bit risky. But I just called it crazy, so that makes it fine. Hmm. Yeah, so I'm giving up a gold general here. That's not good. Yep, yeah, my position is gone. Oh well. Oh, wait, I got a rook. Hang on. Just as I was starting to give in to what a horribly messy position this is, a chance surfaces. Huh. Well then. Nope, this bishop drop 
is potentially still a threat if I like grab something on the wrong square. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right, so you get my rook, I get your rook. It's fair, it's fine. My king's totally safe here. Nothing can go wrong. I might want to block this diagonal at some point. Maybe. But that would take a turn. What else could I do with a turn? Not much. I can't approach this damn thing. My position's so terrible. Um, interesting. Something. What do I even do? Well, that's a move. Enter that in our category of like the least probable moves, but um, in this context, it actually makes a little bit of sense. So if the pawn ends up taking, it blocks the rook. And if the rook ends up taking, okay, yeah, it's a dragon, but now, like, the pawn's in the way again. Uh, mm -hmm. Alright, am I checkmated? What if I just say I'm not checkmated? Let's find out. I can make the claim that I'm not mated. Show me otherwise. I don't know how to defend this. But for one glorious moment, it looks cool. Um, I really don't know how to defend this.
No, this is intense. Thanks for the game. No, no, no. Skill is something it takes an eternity to acquire. I don't know why the app is broken again. We'll go view uh, my rank this way. So, yeah, no. Given, I mean, yeah, every game is a test of your skill. But... You know, I wouldn't, if they're making an honest effort to try to win, and if I'm putting up a, a respectable defense, there's nothing to be ashamed of. So, I think clearly they outplayed me, and they were spending their time well, and I think they were um, making an honest effort to try to checkmate me. I don't think it was trivial. So, anyway, hope we enjoyed this series. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.